My name is uh, Josh Frazier, and uh, this is Black Sheep Skate Shop. I'm the owner. We're located at uh, 1504 Camden Road in Charlotte, North Carolina. Grew up in the area, a uh, lifelong skateboarder, been skating for over 25 years. Part of the motivation for opening the shop just never felt like uh, this area has had a, you know, a skate shop that was skater owned and operated. You know, we've always had shops that were kind of, uh, you know, like a head shop with some skate stuff in the corner, or a surf shop with a little bit of skate stuff in the corner, but nobody that ever really, uh, you know, actually skated and was passionate about it and wanted to make a difference in the community. I guess I, I have a fairly unusual background. I, I actually uh, I went to college and, uh, you know, graduated, studied international business, so I was in the corporate environment. Went back to school to get my master's in business and was doing an evening program, getting my MBA, and uh, was actually laid off uh, during that time period. And just, you know, felt like it was the right time to, to open a, a, a skate shop in Charlotte. And uh, just felt like the scene was really missing that. To open a skate shop in Charlotte was just something, you know, a way for us to like give back to the community. And my only real uh, goal or objective, you know, was just to break even or, you know, even maybe even lose a little bit of money. It just never felt like it was anything that, you know, I could make a living doing. Just something that I wanted to do for the community. I think uh, you know Charlotte's an up-and-coming city. There's been a huge amount of growth over the last uh, you know 10 years. But in general, Charlotte's really been under the radar. North Carolina's uh, always had a real strong skateboard community and skateboard scene. We've had a lot of pros you know that have come out of North Carolina. That's part of the motivation for opening Black Sheep as well. Just feeling like uh, you know wanted to make Charlotte a little more plugged into the skateboard world. The kids are stoked to see you know skateboarding and. Uh, professionals come through town always. You know, we came up with the name of the shop just to, uh, it's really inspired by, you know, people that are independent thinkers and creative individuals, um, somebody who's not afraid to, you know, sort of do their own thing and stand out in a crowd. Uh, for us, we felt like Black Sheep really kind of captured that whole sentiment of, you know, the creative individuals that, you know, do their own thing and march to their own, you know, beat and that sort of thing. You know, obviously we try to carry a great selection, you know, all the major brands. So, you know, I, I say by far we make it a point to have the largest selection of skate hard goods and skate shoes in, in the area. The deluxe stuff does great, you know, anti-hero, real, uh, crooked, that sort of thing. Our crew, Altamont, Maddox, and some of the DGK tees and things like that do really well for us. So, man, that's crazy, you know. I mean, a few years ago we just started seeing, you know, guys that, you know, would show up in the morning to open the shop to unlock the door. And guys were already here just hanging out on the block, you know, hanging on the sidewalk, playing games of skate. Across the street, you know, we kind of joke about it. It's like the Black Sheep TF or whatever. And it's just this 10 by 10, you know, section of sidewalk where there's kids hanging out, you know, day in and day out. No matter how hot, no matter how cold, you know, there's guys out there always hanging out and playing skate. So, and it's, it's not always, you know, guys that are, um, you know, spending money with us necessarily, you know. But it's, it's people that, um, you know, are very supportive of the shop and, you know, get behind what we're doing and so that means a lot to us and we try to look out for them as much as possible. You can't skate because you want to you know be sponsored or get free stuff you know and you can't open a skate shop because you know you want to get rich or make money. You have to do it for the love, you have to do it because you're passionate about it and you have a higher calling if you're doing it for any other reason I think you're not going to be successful.